In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to copy corridor features to microstation elements, just basic microstation elements. So you can see here that I have a, a terrain model and I have a corridor that's been created. So the first thing that I want to do is go into the properties of this corridor. And I'm going to change the design stage to final linear features. And you can see when that processes, as a result, I have the final linear features displayed, such as the ditch, the right edge of pavement, left edge of pavement, etc. So these are the features that I want to copy and turn into just microstation elements. Right now, if you take a look at these, you can see that the left edge of pavement here is a complex element that belongs to the corridor. If you take a look down here, you can see you have a 3D element also belonging to the corridor. So um, the first thing we want to do here is I'm going to go ahead and turn off the display of the terrain model just to get that out of the way. So I'll go into the level display and I'm just going to use off by element. So now we're left with just the linear features. Another thing we want to turn off and get out of the way will be the constructions. So I will go into the view attributes and toggle off constructions. Now let's switch over to the default 3D model. And you can see we have a boundary displayed here for the terrain model. So we're going to turn that off as well. Okay, so all we have left, if we fit the view, all we have left here are the corridor features that we want to copy over. So really everything we've done to this point has been just to, to isolate these. So I'm going to use the place fence command and I'm just going to draw a fence around these elements. And then I'm going to go back into the fence tool set and use the command copy move fence contents to file. I'm going to give this a new name and I'm just going to call it corridor features. processing mode we're going to copy these fence mode is going to be inside so I'm looking down here I see I'm prompted to accept reject my fence content so I'll accept that it processes very quickly and now we can go in and open that new DGN file that was just created and if we take a look at this top view you can see that all the elements are here, all the features are displayed with their correct line styles. If we take a look at them, it no longer shows this as being connected to the corridor. And we're just left with microstation elements.